What's up guys, my name is Frost, well, welcome to the video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Gambit Prime Sniper Rifle known as Lone Survivor. I managed to get the curated role from invading and denying modes when I was invading, but the exact way to get it is unknown to me, but the comment section will probably be able to help you on that. Anyways, mine came with extended barrel, Laird Bagwell, Outlaw, Snapshot, and Reload Masterwork. This is not the best PvP sniper rifle uh, other than Snapshot. Here on the screen, I'm going to show you the perks you can get on it, and the ones that I recommend would be extended mag, appended mag, or high caliber rounds, ricochet rounds, flare mag wheel, armor piercing rounds, and those are your options. Now, these are all meant to give you some sort of benefit on the sniper in terms of range or mag increase. Anyways, the next perk would be opening shot instead of outlaw, and then finally, you would have snapshot. In terms of massive work, you can go for handling, stability, or range. Probably range would be the one that I suggest for you to get. And how does this compare for my other adaptive frame sniper rifle known as the Long Goodbye? Well, Long Goodbye has better stats, but you know, you have another activity where you can grind for such sniper archetype. Anyways, in terms of primary, I'm going to be using Huckleberry, and I have been trying to get some different gameplay with different weapons, but right now, PC is a little bit difficult to play with all the Not Forgotten shotguns, Last Word, and Ace of Spades running, running around, so I am trying my best. Anyways, in terms of exotic armor, I'm not using any. I am using uh, perks to help my sniper SMG loadout. I'm using middle tree striker, flashbang grenades, and that pretty much covers my loadout. Anyways, if you like what you see, drop a like to support me and the channel. Thank you for being here. Let's get into the live com. Okay, we just got control on a pretty good map, Burnout. We got some good close range engagements for the Huckleberry. And of course, we got some nice little long ranges for the sniper rifle. I'm going to go to the left side, but I'm going to be pretty slow about this engagement because I don't want to get shotgunned or grenaded instantly. Just like that. That grenade's going to cause me to back off so I can get my health back. See if I can peek with a sniper here. Go for the body. Nice, nice. Came and finished him off. Got some more sniper in our back. Let's try to get a peek here at B. Got a body shot. That's two down. I'm very weak, so I'm going to back off. He's chasing, actually. Don't know what he was thinking of doing with that uh, play. <laughs> I'm more worried about the guy on the left here. This guy wanted a melee, so I slid under. So I could try to avoid the melee lock on. Go for the double body shot right there. Got some more special ammo to pick up right here. I'm predicting a spawn flip pretty soon. No, nothing. It looks like we have too many people inside for them to really get a spawn flip going. Put our grenade there. That graviton's gonna flinch me off target. Might potentially get a guy going left. Teammate pushed me a little bit there. I'm trying to be smart about these engagements here. We can get a Huckleberry melee push here. And we can start getting a little bit aggressive on these guys. Uh, someone fell off the map. <laughs> He's like, I don't want to be in this world no more. Let's see this guy across the map. Fire team that fights together stays together. Pull shuffle flinch a little bit scary, but we did get the body shot off of him. Is there another one here? No, he got finished off. Got some special ammo to play for here. Nice. Team did a pretty good job right there. 
Did we get sniped? This guy off the flag. Only hit a body shot. Let's throw a flashbang there. I'm gonna go Superman punch right here. So we can get a tag. Okay, we got our Huckleberry reload. I'm pretty weak, but we do have extra damage, so that's gonna help us getting that finisher right there. I already have my super as well, so I can make a play to counter someone else's super at some point in the game. Taking a look at a flag. He wasn't aware that I had the angle. Gotta watch that radar. Got that snipe too. One more in front of me. He has a bow. I might actually burn out right here. He hit a pretty good bow. Okay. Keeping my my life right there. I'll re-challenge now. Got the snipe. This guy's a little bit too fast in the trigger pull. So if I want to snipe him, I have to make sure I instantly shoot him. Oh, wait, what? I didn't even see the frisbee throw, bro. What was that? He was just standing still. I could have reacted with a, you know, a striker panic super, man. Snap this guy. Got a body shot. Got the Huckleberry Rampage. Nice. Got that two piece. I'm going to reload. Get the team shot with my teammate. Got the extra Huckleberry reload and damage. But there's not going to be anybody else to follow up with. Snipe this guy. Trying to get some snipes on these guys before the Spectral Blitz got to them, but not going to be possible. I have to hide in the cover for a little bit just to bait his attention and make him, you know, sway his aim a little bit. So usually when you do some pop shots like that where you go back into cover, you know, they have to relocate their aim and if they keep spraying, they're basically... Woo! They can basically end up missing because you're in cover. It's just some mind tricks. Mind tricks that help. Oh, poor guy got spawn killed. Sorry about that, man. Oh, I missed some free shots. Hey, it's always the easiest snipes. I can't hit. We're gonna panic super. I'm not trying to die to the level 19. Sorry, man. Not today. Not today. Not today. I'm not dying to the level 19s today. Got a body shot. I'm pretty weak now. Five minutes left. Keep it up. Flashbang. Should be multiple targets middle. Ooh, that's an enemy Nova Bomb. Ah. Might be a super here too. I hear the Sunbreaker. Yep. Hear the flames. Ooh. He almost got me with that. Let's get the special ammo while we're here. It might as well get the power ammo sensor right here too. Show your enemy what a real we're working towards a rerun out of metals if we keep playing like this. He has a one-eyed mass over shield. Doesn't have me targeted though, so that's a good thing. Might see some players on the left. That's a pulse rifle shot. He's gonna barrage my teammate right there. Nice, we got those two snipes. We're gonna pick this guy. Level 19. Ah, now we went down. Nice shots. Got distracted. I got a little bit too ahead of myself. I wanted to push that and continue the feed, but all good. Let's take a look at A Fly. Gets a shot. He has a hand cannon, so his pop shots are doing a lot more damage. Oh, I think I took too long getting that kill. Yeah, I was a little bit overconfident in that, in that too right there because I wanted to just spray my shots and, you know, in the back of my head, it was like, it doesn't matter how many shots I miss because I'll get a reload instantly due to the catalyst of the Huckleberry, just instantly auto-reloading everything. Obviously, in that situation, it didn't work out for me. Got to kill that guy as quick as possible. Snipe the word cliff player. Ooh. I did not see you. Hey. I might die from behind. Yeah. Zone C lost. Power play. So these guys have triple flags right now, but I'm not I'm not worried here. I know we could pretty much win this game already. Just with a couple more kills and just pop up, you know, some supers. 
Let's go Superman play here. Go for a striker smash at the back here. Managed to get one. It's gonna be one at A flag. He has a auto rifle of some sort. Snap one. This guy's a sentinel. Trying to go for the sniper headshot. He's just gonna <laughs> block and push me. Darn it. But he's gonna be out of super here pretty soon, anyways. Let's throw a flash frame, blind him. Ooh, that's a sunbreaker. Let me just back off as quick as possible before he gets, you know, multi kill on us. That's one. Striker smash melee here. That's game already. Not a bad match. We had some really good map control the entire time. We didn't die many times and we were just sniping people off flags, you know, keeping the pressure on with our team. So that's definitely a match where me and my teammates just have absolute map control. GG's, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.